Hey, before this video starts, I just want to say thank you for the support. I really do appreciate it. I'm trying to get 100,000 subscribers, so if you want to help me out, make sure to subscribe. Now enjoy the video. That's strange. In here I thought that if I be here, I would actually have somewhat of a fight. Mm, too bad. Well, at least there is enough food for me and my sister. Huh? Hmm. Would you look at that? Another appetizer, just for me. Hmm. Look at you. Not a blemish or a birthmark on that skin of yours. And you're quite built as well. You must be popular with all types of people. Oh, I envy that of you. Oh, I envy that of you. Why don't you just go drop dead and in the most agonizing way at that? Maybe even getting your skin ripped off or even getting that belly of yours slit open like a pig. Huh? Why you draw your blade at me? You already know what kind of demon I already am. And yet, you still want to try. Why? Why do you have so much intent to cutting my head off? I'll make you pay for what you want to do to me. You're nothing but a squealing pig, and you are going to be nothing but a corpse after I'm done with you? Hmm. You changed your mannerism. Why? I thought you wanted to kill me. Huh? Why have such a sudden change of heart? In here I thought I was different. But humans are exactly the same as I am. They change their motives if they ever sense just a slight of damage or even danger at that. Tell me. What is your name, so I don't forget it once I got you? Hmm. And such a pretty name as well. You must be popular. How is that? How is that knowing that people actually want you to be around you? Huh? Don't give me that crap! I've lived through enough torment and pain just trying to get food in my stomach for me and my sister. My beautiful sister, Daki. She was the most beautiful thing I could ever lay eyes on. But now, we both live just to kill humans for our next meal. But we gain strength as we kill. You see, me and my sister are high-ranking moons. 
us together, we killed about more than a dozen Hashira in my lifetime. And a simple swordsman is not gonna get in my way. Nor in my sister's way at all. Don't you get it? You're supposed to be scared of me. Why aren't you scared? <laughs> come on! Come on! Come on! Did you really think a demon could have a change of heart? <laughs> What a silly, silly sense of change. You have no idea, do you? The type of people I've seen. You humans are just the same. All you do is look out for yourselves. Like wild animals. Only the strongest survive. It's naturally like the food chain. The weak get zeroed out. And none of us survive. I fought through all sorts of damages. We've survived through harsh winters, beatings and even slashings from different human beings that we could have called friends. But they turned their back on us, treat us us like the pigs in the fields. Oh, for the way I wish I could have got them sooner. I should have done it long. Long time ago. No. No, you don't understand. You really, really don't understand. Me and my sister have gone through hell and back just to stay alive. You know what that's like, don't you? Everything you could have possibly had, you do. Me and my sister had to fight for even just a crumb of bread. And even a drop of water when we were humans. But luckily, when... I was protecting my sister in the harsh winter. I saw a demon, and he said that he could change us. He could let us live a new life, but serve under the demon lord Muzan. I couldn't be even more grateful for what he did for us. He gave us purpose. He gave us a new life to live. To conquer. To survive. You humans would never understand the type of pain that me and my sister had to go through. I see it now. You humans are more of a monster than me and my sister will ever be. You, you, you deserve for what you get. Blood demon art. Flying blood sickles! 
<laughs> Although I did sense that you were strong, not physically, but mentally, I will respect you and make you a meal worth eating. Mm-hmm. <laughs>